COLAC stands for Trial of Labor After a C-Section. This is a big topic in obstetrics uh, because the C-section rate in the United States is pretty high com and compared to other parts of the world. Um, and we want to try to minimize that as much as possible. OBGYN Dr. Jeff Smith says if you look at the data, about 80 plus percent of patients will have a repeat C-section after their first one for whatever reason. Um, and with each subsequent surgery, right, theoretically risk for things like more bleeding, infection, more difficult uh, intraoperative complexity um, can occur. Dr. Smith says is why the goal is vaginal delivery. That's typically what I tell my patients, like this is the data, um, these are the risks, and we feel like you can safely do this if you want to. It can also be safer for the baby. Things like um, temporary issues with breathing um, are going to be a little bit higher with a C-section versus a vaginal delivery, uh, potentially maybe some um, glycemic control, so blood sugars in the baby. Um, we might not deal with that as much with a vaginal delivery. Speak with your OBGYN if you've had a prior C-section. And then we can continue to discuss it at subsequent visits as the pregnancy progresses, as risk factors present themselves or don't present themselves, hopefully. You can learn more by searching for obstetrics and gynecology on leehealth.org. For Lee Health, I'm Devin Turk.